Hello guys, welcome to my new video. In this one we are going to unbox Alpha Wise U20. So as you can see this is a very big box. It's not as big as the box of CR10 or CR10S. It's a little bit smaller, a little bit lightweight. Of course it's like half of the price. But let's see what's inside this box. We are able to get the bottom section of the Alpha Wise. So this is how it looks. Actually, I'm like impressed with this blue color. It looks really nice, and there are a little bit red the stepper colors in here. And everything is black, and cable is very organized too. So this is the bottom section of Arrowhead. So what comes out is another box. So we will check this box out too. Okay, let's look at the box a little bit more closer. Right now, this is the control panel that we have. So I'm going to take off the control panel. Everything is like cables are organized again, and we are going to take this control panel off. It's weird that this screen is very small, the controller screen, and we are going to see how it is gonna function in the next video. And this is the top section of the Alpha Y. So let us remove the top section too. It is very very similar to CR10. As you can see, we have the extruder unit located in here. These are the cable sections that we have. And this is the entire top part. We have the extruder motor over here. And we can see the motor coupling connection here with the stepper motor. It's very similar to CR10. This thing has a filament detector system right over here located. CR10 doesn't have the filament detector system. CR10S have. It's great that Alphawise U20 has a filament detector system located on the extruder. But again, it has like one Z axis motor. Doesn't have the second one over here. So let's continue to other pieces. Okay, right now let us open this small box and see what is inside exactly. We have our power cord. Very nice Allen wrenches. All the Allen wrenches that we will need are in here. And we have T connectors, same as CR10 and CR10S. And we have micro SD reader. We have an extra filament, which is in the yellow color, which is great. I always see white colors, never seen a yellow color. And we have a spatula, and this is a USB cable. We have some zip ties for more organization. We have a plier and some wrenches and screwdrivers. We also have a very, very cool, very, very cool filament holder. And this is the other connection units for the filament holder. Okay, let's continue to unbox the bottom section of the Alpha Y. So we are going to remove this. We need to cut these sections. So I remove the bottom section too. So as you can see, this is what the fuck. This is not good. And underneath, as you can see, the rail and the bed and the, all these connections. This is how it looks. Okay, guys, this is the end of Alpha Vice U20 unboxing video. As you can see, all the parts are on the table. And in the next video, we are going to make an assembly of this entire thing and show you step by step how to assemble Alpha Vice U20. Don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel by clicking the link somewhere around here. And in total we will make 5 Alphawise U20 videos including a review video and a comparison of it with CR10S. Also guys, this video is sponsored by Brian. Here is the Brian. Thank you Brian for sponsoring us, our channel with Alphawise U20. Do you wanna say hi to the viewers? Yeah, hello. Uh, subscribe this guy. Yeah. <laughs> Thank I you so him. much. I love him. <laughs> Thank you. And this guy will see the pain <laughs> of Alpha Wise U20 or the beauty of, or the beauty of Alpha Wise U20. We don't know yet. We will see. Keep subscribing and see you in the next four videos. Bye. That's sweet. <laughs>